Good morning, everybody, and it's me, Danielle, Lady Diva, however you want to refer to me, coming to you guys with again with another motivational message on this Monday morning, and I am excited, you guys, about what has dropped into my heart to share with you guys today. Yes, it is a bright, it is colorful on today, um, and you guys will see why I kind of chose this garment today. But today, I'm excited about the word that has dropped in my heart today. If you guys want to hear about it is time for a revolution, then do not click off this video. Okay, guys, here we go. I'm telling you, this has been burning in my heart for a while now. And I had to give it today because with everything that has been happening in this country, everything that has been happening even around the world, spiritually and naturally, it is time for a revolution and so when we look up the word revolution and I did look up the word revolution the revolution comes from the word revolt and when you look even at the season of re as we have shifted and we are walking in our purposes and in our destiny and the shifting has happened not only in our spiritual lives in our individual lives but you guys the the very fabric of this country has shifted the very atmosphere of this world has shifted and we must be ready to be able to do something positive and effective in this shift. And so now as we are getting ready, it's still kind of revolt or revolution. Um, we're still talking a little bit about the season of re. And so as I move on and I was looking at the word revolt, the, the um, definitions that I find, I like to make sure you guys understand where I'm coming from, is the action of moving around something in a path that is circular, similar to a circle. It is time to encircle some stuff. A sudden extreme or complete change. A sudden extreme or complete change in the way people live, work, think, move, etc. I got excited, you guys. And then, there, of, co of course, it talks about the violent attempts to overthrow governments and this, things like that. That's not what I'm talking about. I'm not talking about physical violence. I'm not talking about any of that at all. But what I am talking about is that there is a shifting in the way that people, ch the way people think, the way people live, the people work, and the things that people do. And this is something that really blessed me too. A fundamental change in the way of thinking about or visualizing something. A change of paradigm. Those who know me know I have been talking about the paradigm shift for over five years. God gave me the word. There is a paradigm shift that is going to happen. Five years ago, God gave me that word. Five years ago, I was on K-Pro Radio and God told me, to do a study on the paradigm shift. So I have tapes and tapes of talking about the paradigm shift that God already talked about what happened is happening right now. So you guys, God said it is now time for the revolution. The manifestation of that is happening right now. It is time for us to change the way we think, to change the way we move, to change the way we act, to change the way we feel. It is perception changing time. It is time for a revolution. And I, you say, what are you talking about? I'm talking about those that are spiritually and know how to get a prayer through prayer warriors it's time for a revolution there's a scripture in the bible that says that the the suffer violence the kingdom suffered violence thank you lord and the violent take it by force now god is not talking about violent and going and looting and white and all that type of stuff no that's not what we're talking about we're talking about in the spiritual realm there is a radical revolution happening in the spiritual realm and it is now taking place in the natural realm and we must respond you guys it is time for a revolution it is time for us to change the way that we act and change the things that we do because if you do the same things you are definitely going to get the same results come on somebody and so now it's time for a change we must do some radical things to let people know that we're going to rise up we are not going to take things anymore lying down and i'm not talking about violence please understand what i'm saying but i'm talking about getting on your knees in prayer and seeking god and asking him, like, Lord, what can I do to make a difference? Even in your purpose, even in your destiny, even in your ministry, even in the promises that God has given you. It is now time for you to shift. It is now time for you to paradigmly shift. I feel this in my spirit on this morning. It is time for you to shift into what God has given you to do. It is time for you to shift your thinking, shift your perspective. If you only prayed once a day, maybe God is saying it's time for you to shift. You need to be praying three times a day. If you never were a witness, maybe it's time for you to, to start crying aloud and sparing not. Definitely it's time for our lights to shine brightly. 
so that people will know that there is a better way to do things. There is a better hereafter that is taking place. And so it is time for a revolution. It is time for us to rise up. And that's the colors today because, <laughs> you know, sometimes they say red and black and yellow might be colors of fire and, and excitement and shining. And so all of these colors represent something that will be able to revolutionize. It is time to move forward. It is time to stand up. There is no more sitting down. There is no more being complacent. There is no more being comfortable. But it is time to come out of your comfort zone because the paradigm shift has already happened and we must be prepared and in step and in formation to move forward in this shift. It is time for a revolution. It is time to change the way that things are moving in this planet. And the only way that we can do that is by prayer. The only way we can do that is by giving God the glory and the right a place that he belongs in. America must realize that this country was founded on the foundation of God. In God we trust. No matter how any other way you want to look at it. And we have gotten away from that. It's time for a revolution. It is time to change. It is time to move. It is time to live. It is time to move forward. So I hope I'm helping somebody with this. In your spiritual life. It is time for a revolution in your spirit. It is time for a revolution in your soul. It is time for you to change the perspective that you may have. And it's time for you to get radical for what you believe. It is time for you to cry out for God. It is time for you to testify and let people know that Jesus is Lord and that he is real and that most of all he is soon to come. It is time for a revolution. I hope you guys enjoyed this word on today. I am excited to move forward. You guys do not forget about um, the Tuesday Bible study tomorrow. It is a word that is going to blow your hair back, women. Be in tune. Facebook Live at 11 a.m. Please share, share, share this video with those who are tired of the status quo, who are tired of the same old thing, but they want to see change. But you must be the change first before somebody else will be able to have a part of the change. It is time for revolution. I love you guys, and I will talk to you in the next one. Bye-bye.